What's going on guys this is me Mehdi Shakil and you are watching it's a stake tutorial. So guys in this video I am going to show you that how you can set up the docker desktop on a windows 11 computer so that you can easily follow this video and install the docker desktop on your windows 11 computer. So further ado let's get started. But before that if you are new to this channel then please do subscribe this youtube channel and if you have already subscribed then thank you so much. Ok guys. Now you can see my computer screen. Now to install the docker desktop on a windows 11 computer you have to make sure you are using the latest version of windows 11 operating system and also you have enabled the virtual machine platform and install the WSL or windows subsystem for linux on your windows computer. If I press on my keyboard windows plus R key and type here winvar then press enter you can see the version i am using and the build number of this windows 11 operating system you have to make sure you are using the latest version of windows 11 operating system ok now you have to enable the virtual machine platform so click on start and search for turn windows feature on and off then click here to open it you will get this type of pop up now you scroll down and search for virtual machine platform in my case it's already enabled you will not get this check mark on this option so to enable this virtual machine platform you have to select it then click on ok and after some time it will ask you to reboot your system and you have to follow that restart your computer and now you have to install the windows subsystem for linux on your windows 11 computer so you have to open microsoft store then click on this search bar and search for wsl then you have to click on this install button to get this windows subsystem for linux installed on your computer it's gonna take some time so you have to wait until the downloading and installation has been completed now the installation has been completed if you just click on this open button it will start your command prompt and it will be installed now we have completed all the prerequisite to install the docker desktop in our windows 11 computer after that open up your browser and search on google docker desktop then go to this first website docker.com and click on this download docker desktop button to get the docker desktop installer on your computer i had already downloaded it so i'm not going to download it again now if i go to my downloads folder here you can see i have the docker desktop installer.exe file now to start installing you have to double click on this installer here you can see initializing has been started you have to make sure you select this option use wsl2 instead of hyper-v because this is the recommended one to run the docker desktop then click on ok and it should start installing the docker desktop on your windows 11 computer it also gonna take some time so you have to wait until the installation has been completed ok guys now you can see the docker desktop installation has been succeeded now you can click on close now to start the docker desktop click on start menu and search for docker then click on this docker desktop and it will start the docker desktop on your computer now here you can see we have successfully installed the docker desktop on our windows 11 computer if you want the easy tutorial you can click on start or you can just skip the tutorial now to make sure everything works fine you can run this testing docker container just copy this command from here open up your terminal or command prompt and paste this command then press enter and it will start downloading this testing docker container from the internet here you can see it's pulling the docker container and downloading all the requirement files okay now if i open my browser and visit to localhost here you can see the getting started docker container has been successfully running using our docker desktop now to remove or close this docker container just click on this stop sign and it will stop the docker container and now to remove it just click on this trash icon then delete forever now like this you can easily run any type of docker container on your windows 11 computer also you can get the docker containers from the docker hub using this docker desktop application just click on this search icon then go to hub images then click here and search for any docker container let's search ubuntu and here you can see we get the ubuntu docker container now to get this docker container click on this pull button and now this ubuntu docker container should get downloaded in our computer and run it for us also you can copy this command from here and can paste it on your terminal to get this ubuntu docker container now after downloading if you go to images here you can see we have the ubuntu docker container and now to start the ubuntu docker container you can press on this run button and to remove all of this docker container you can click here and click on delete then delete forever like this you can easily run any type of docker container locally or you can get from the docker hub and run it on your computer using this docker desktop so guys that's all for today i hope you like this video 
If you really like this video and enjoy this video then please give it a big thumbs up and share this video with your friends. And guys if you are new to this channel then please do subscribe to this YouTube channel and don't forget to press the bell icon to get all the latest upcoming video tutorial notification. I am Mehdi Shakil, you are watching Instructive Tutorial and I am signing out.